What's up, party people? It's your boy, Voltron Supreme, coming at you again with another Anchor Speculation video. So let's get started. I was in a bookstore reading a book, and suddenly a guy, completely nervous, drops a map on my desk and tells me, it's just missing an A, it's just missing an A. And it was a map of Lingnang. It's a region that covers part of China and Vietnam. I was about to ask him a question, but then the police came in and took him away. And I know it wasn't regular police. I know it was the anchor Illuminati that took him away, but he left us a clue. He said, it's just missing an A. It has to do with anchor. So this is something we need Recon Dave to look into. Noses, chain, and anchor. It's not really a new relationship. We know that Ryan Fang and Noses have worked together a lot and they like to work with DeFi, especially because they use their stable coin, which makes working in DeFi a lot easier, given that a lot of people are afraid to invest in something when they're afraid the prices are gonna fluctuate a lot. So having that stable coin makes it easier. But the relationship didn't see much activity until lately, but this time not from Ryan Fang, but from Stanley Wu. Stanley Wu had a transaction with the Gnosis chain, a big transaction. And we know he's the tech guy at Anchor. And he did a transaction with the Gnosis chain. You know, we know that Anchor has been working with EVMs. Anchor has been working with multi-chain. So what is Gnosis and Anchor building? That's the question and we're still looking into it. But we know that there's something being worked on. Anyway guys, I'm not affiliated with Anchor. I'm not affiliated with Gnosis. Always do your own due diligence. So until next time, peace out and safe investment.